be a miracle if I ever realised my dream of winning a Premier League title. Not my words, the words of Steven Gerrard. Yes, the Liverpool captain must be doubly frustrated when he looks at fierce rivals Manchester United and sees some of the terrible players that have won winners medals. Here's ten of them. Sexy, good looking, great dribbler, you've guessed it, I'm talking about Luke Chadwick who made 16 appearances in the 2000-2001 season for Manchester United, picking up his Premier League trophy the same time that Gerrard picked up a League Cup, FA Cup and UEFA Cup treble. Remember playing Sunday League football and the manager's dad always put his son in the team even though he was rubbish? Darren Ferguson played 15 games before Eric Cantona came into the side in November. Well, United went on to win the league, and Fergie Jr. only played three more games after that. He still picked up his winner's medal, but he was sold the next season, because he was rubbish. Incredibly, this guy behind me has three winner's medals. Three! That's mental! Well, we all remember Roy Carroll, don't we? Most famous for spilling a Pedro Mendes shot well over the goal line against Spurs at Old Trafford. Mm. He played eight games that season, 2003, picking up his medal, but he's a very lucky man because in 2004, he came on as a sub in the FA Cup final against Millwall and picked up an FA Cup winner's trophy as well. He is lucky, very lucky indeed. Do you remember Johan Cruyff? Do you remember the Cruyff turn? Yeah? Yeah, I think that's how it went. Anyway, well, he had a son, Jordi Cruyff, who played for Manchester United in 96-97. He played 11 games that season, picking up a winner's medal, but thanks mainly to the brilliance of Eric Cantona. Darren Gibson, or Darren Gibson to his friends, the fact that he spells his name with an O is enough to put him on this list of shame. David May. Signed from Blackburn in 1994, and Rovers missed him so much that season that they went on to win the Premier League. May played 11 games in the following season as United struck back. And the season after that, he played 29 games. But guess what? That season, United recorded the lowest points total of any title-winning side in Premier League history. Kieran Richardson, to be fair, was quite a promising talent. But in the 2006-2007 winning title side, he was relegated to the reserves. But he did fight his way back to play enough games to pick up a medal. Well done, Kieran. You the man. Ronnie Woolwick. Now, Ronnie Woolwick was... Um, Ronnie Woolwick was banned from football for life for attacking a referee, later reduced to a three-year ban, two of which were suspended, also jailed for 15 months for receiving stolen goods. Yeah, well, he pretty much stole his Premier League winner's medal as well. <laughs> Michael Owen, one of Europe's best strikers, but not really when he signed for Manchester United in 2009. A shock signing by Fergie at the time, and the reason I'm sitting down is because Michael spent most of his time at United on the bench. Hi, my name is Gianluca Vialli and you're watching Talk Sport on YouTube. Click here to subscribe. <laughs>